Hi, this is Peter from Super Talent, and today I want to introduce you to our TerraDrive CT3. Now, this one fits right in the middle between our TerraDrive CT2, which was SATA 2 in a synchronous standard traditional NAND, and our new PT3, which is SATA 3 and a new type of flash. It's double data rate. This happens to be Omphi. Well, now we've come out with this CT3, which is SATA 3 and traditional. Uh, flash. So this is going to enable us to get the maximum speed that we can out of traditional flash. How fast is it? Let's take a look. It's pretty impressive. There we go. Now I'm going to first show you the 240 gig capacity and I've set it up as you would on a server, a queue depth of 10. And you'll notice the scores are absolutely phenomenal. Let's see, I see a 551 read and 519 on the right. That's great. Now, the way you set it up on a desktop applications is usually with um, Q, Q depth of 2, and we still see over 500 on the reads and 500 on the writes. I'm looking at 531 and 514, respectively. Those are good scores. All right, let's, let's jump to a different capacity. I'll show you how capacity plays a role here. Capacity does play a role. Here we are looking at 120. It's minor. It's not much of a difference, but uh, I'm looking at scores of over 500, 527, 502. Um, actually, that's a queued up to two. So the 547 and 511 are the best I see right here. Let me jump through these. 64 capacity. Um, we still hit over 500. I don't see any 500s on the rights, though. So capacity does matter. Let's take a look. Here's a different, uh, this is HD Tune Pro, the 240 gigabyte capacity. We're looking at 521 uh, on a, well, actually, the average is 524 uh, for, for the reads and for the writes. We're looking at, uh, let's see, the average is 464. It's a good score. Here's the 120. You can pause it if you need to. Let me just jump through it. The 64, still very good scores. 500 versus 469 is the max I see over there. All right, now here's a different program. Uh, you know, a lot of you ask for different programs. So I wanted to put them all in there. 240, 120, and 64. Again, pause it if you need to. I just want to get through as many as I can. Crystal Disk Mark. Now, it's important to put this one because Crystal Disk Mark, uh, the way I have it set up here, it has uncompressible data or very hard to compress data. And these are the minimum scores. This is if you were working with uh, files that are already tarred or zipped. These are some scores you'd see. Look at this. The write scores definitely uh, change with capacity. It's important to notice. Hey, here's the test platform we used in order to get these scores. It's a little bit about it. You can find us on our website, supertalent.com. Click on the Where to Buy button to find a retailer in your area. Um, Thank you very much for watching. Hey, favorite us on, on the web and you'll see all of our new announcements. Thanks again.